Well, it may be time to reevaluate your work schedule if you're thinking of having children soon. A new study finds pregnant women who work nights may have a greater risk of miscarriage. Women who work two or more night shifts in a week where 32 more percent likely to miscarry the following week. The study has a lot of people concerned and could possibly spark new legislation overseas. Joining us now, 11 Alive medical correspondent Dr. Sujatha Reddy. And Dr. Reddy, what is it about a night shift that could be detrimental to a pregnancy? Yeah, and first we have to say though, this is an observational study. This is not a direct cause and effect. But what we think is happening is the women that stay up late at night their circadian rhythm, that rhythm of going to sleep and waking up gets disrupted and their bodies may produce decreased amounts of melatonin. And we think melatonin helps keep a baby in the uterus. So what about people who have to work at night? Because some folks don't necessarily have a choice. You're right, and that's one thing we definitely need to bring up. If you've had a miscarriage and work nights, do not kick yourself, do not blame yourself. Mm -hmm. It's way too soon to say again that this is a direct cause and effect. But I think it's worth more research and that's what's going to happen. But I think if you're thinking of having a baby or you've been pregnant or had a miscarriage, try to control the things you can control. That's like be at a healthy weight. Try to live a clean, healthy lifestyle. Eat Eat well, be active. If you have chronic medical conditions like high blood pressure, diabetes, keep them under control. Definitely be under the care of a doctor. And we know miscarriage risk goes up if you're older. So if possible, try to have your kids as early as you can. That's not always practical. But again, not a direct cause and effect, but an interesting study that needs more research. Anything else women can do to maximize productivity and make sure things are okay and they're having as healthy a pregnancy as possible? I think the main thing to remember is that we plan everything in our lives. If you're thinking of having a baby, plan that too. Get care, see a doctor before you try to get pregnant. Make sure medications are safe that you're on, your health conditions are appropriate, immunizations up to date. Start out healthy, you have a better chance through it through that way. All right, Dr. Reddy, always great to have you. Thank you so much.